We smoke and filter and crack, you stupid piece of shit. Uh, 295 moved well. Um, definitely, I would say like RP 5-ish, which is crazy to think that a triple at 295 for me is a five at this point. Um, what I will say is mobility is going to have to be a major, major focus going forward because I'm struggling to really hit depth. Um, all of my squats today have been 50-50 calls, and we can't have that because we saw it calm. Well, I guess we didn't see a comp. Still waiting on footage. Um, but quick recap of comp. Overall, went six for nine. Um, while I went six for nine, I technically only failed two lifts. My first ever attempt uh, on the platform, I completely missed. Didn't hear my name called. And uh, unfortunately, the minute passed before I could get onto the platform, and that was that. Uh, going into attempt number two, which was really my first attempt for the comp, Hit 3.30 with ease, with ease. Uh, three white lights, felt really good. Went up to 3.70, and unfortunately, um, they called me parallel, which is not a good squat. So I got one white, uh, two reds. The middle judge said I hit depth. Uh, two side judges said I was parallel, so it is what it is. Bench went three for three, super happy about that. Started at 2.52, moves fairly smooth, super simple, definitely like an RP like six or seven, which then went into 265 for my second attempt. Again, moved with ease, no big deal. And then went up to 281, which is the new PR. Um, the best thing that happened about the 281 was I didn't throw my back out. Um, now, should it have truly counted? Two judges said yes, one judge said no. The center judge said uh, up and down on my left side, but the side judges said it was good, so it's a good lift. Um, so, Super happy about that, considered a PR. Then deads, uh, 275 moves with ease, no issues whatsoever. And then we had 408, which moved with ease, no issues, and I was feeling good, so it went up to 452. 452.8, um, which is an all-time PR for me. Got one white light, um, didn't have my knees fully locked out, so soft knees, and it is what it is. But going back to now, it's technically block four, but really block one into uh, the new the new meet goal. Um, should be competing in either late July or early September. Uh, it's just gonna come down to which meet I choose. I'd prefer the September one because it's local, but at the same time, no big deal. But huge shout out to uh, my fiance, Brooke. She qualified for nationals. So she will be competing in Niagara Falls and it's sick like so proud of her she qualified as a class one the minimum is a class two so she blew that out of the water with her openers so proud of her can't wait for her to continue this powerlifting journey but now it's my turn to, to try to qualify for uh nats going forward so let's finish off squat and then we still have bench self squat shoulder press weighted dips leg extension we still got a lot to do so let's jump in Easy, let's go. We're gonna have a little promo video of what uh, this next meet is really gonna mean to me. And really, um, the mindset going forward because to say there's a lot of pent up anger and frustration and disappointment um, with some of my results but also unfortunately with others um, it's going to be a good 
good block, and I'm excited to keep on pushing it. It really is a you against the world kind of mentality at this point. One more set, one more set. Get tight, get tight. Get tight. <laughs> It for squats. Uh, we will throw in the bench footage as well as because that's really it. We only really need to see the compounds. But move on to bench three by five RP six. So probably gonna be around 205 ish, 205 to 215. See how everything feels and go from there. But until next time, it's been your boy Dreamer Boy. Don't stop believing, don't stop dreaming. And uh, let's go into this next block. It's a lot of momentum, a lot of anger. And let's prove the world wrong. Peace.